So finally, CMF Phone 1 has been launched and it is not what I was expecting. I know many of you will troll me for this but let's be real for now. I appreciate what CMF has done with the customization feature but I'm not happy with the hardware, camera and what it offers at that price point. Everyone is praising the phone's customization options, you can remove the back panel and replace it with your choice of colors. By the way, there are only 4 colors to choose from and they must be purchased separately. The phone also comes with other useful attachments and what we initially thought was a volume knob to control the volume but it turns out to be a dialer to help remove the back panel. This is very cool stuff but there is some compromises. Due to the removable back panel, the phone comes with a IPX2 rating which provides very little protection from water. There is a high chance of water and dust easily getting inside the phone if you do not tighten the screws on the back panel. Additionally, I am also unhappy with the display, the bezels are thick and even bottom chin is thicker. Comparing it to the Nothing Phone 1 which came with a uniform symmetrical bezels but the CMF Phone 1 has let us down in that department. However, I do appreciate that the phone features a 6.67 inches 120Hz adaptive AMOLED display with a 2000 nits brightness which also supports HDR10+. The CMF Phone 1 comes with a MediaTek Dimensity 7300 which is shockingly weaker than the Dimensity 7200. It's unclear what the reasoning is behind the numbering of these processors. You will be surprised to hear that the Dimensity 7300 is a successor of the Dimensity 7050, not the 7200. I don't know who is naming the CPU at MediaTek but considering the price it is coming at, they should have chosen a different processor. Talking about the cameras, there is a 50 megapixel f1.8 lens and a 2 megapixel sensor for portrait photos. At first impression, it does a good job of taking photos and videos with the images coming out punchy in colors. However, in some areas, the saturation drops a bit which we should be mindful of. CMF will also sell other accessories of the phone separately, including a phone stand, a magnetic case and a lanyard for phone protection, I suppose. Overall, the CMF Phone 1 is good for those who love to customize their phone and do not care about the other specifications. And for those who care about the specs, the CMF Phone 1 is a decent phone. For example, if I decide to get this phone, I will wait for some time to see other brands phones that are launching at this price point. By the way, these are the official prices of the CMF Phone 1. Let me know what you think of this phone, do you agree with me or leave a comment with your thoughts. With that being said, subscribe if, with that being said, subscribe if you like and I will see you in the next one.